The Beaverton, how to survive finals week. So, finals week is coming up, and you're one of the stupid, stupid morons who decided to pursue higher education. If you want to get through this week, you'll need to prepare yourself. Final season is all about expanding your mind, and the easiest way to do that is to destroy your body. Buy the most fatty, disgusting snacks you can find. Pork rinds, deep fried potato chips, and lard pops are a good place to start. Next is caffeine. Some people like to joke about getting an IV full of coffee for exams. That's ridiculous. If you want to stay awake, you're going to need to snort it. You'll also need to stake out a good spot in the library. When you find one, make sure to have several extremely sharp pencils you can use to ward off interlopers. And remember, mercy is for the weak. Find a similarly stressed out person to fuck. Partly to relax, but mostly because 90% of epiphanies happen at the moment of orgasm. This is how you'll finish your essay comparing Machiavelli's The Prince to the Beat Generation. When it comes to studying for exams, there are two schools of thought. Either you attempt to cram all the information into your brain the night before the test, or you do it the morning of. Some scientists believe there is a third option involving planning, taking notes, and attending class. But this method has never been observed. And remember, if none of this works, just stay tuned for our follow-up video, How to Complain Your Way to a B+. Now you know how to survive finals week. <laughs>